Hi, my name is Leona Hudson, and this presentation is the benchmark for the assignment Southwest Transit. I will be presenting to you the team selected for the Southwest Marketing Team Management Project. The objective of the project is to develop a marketing team to introduce a new campaign to maintain customer loyalty. We have a vision for success that creates that we would like to create a collaborative team with leadership oversight to mitigate and minimize conflict to optimize productivity of the team. To create this team, we decided to use a homogeneous group to maximize cooperation and to achieve the outcome goals. The selected team members for the project include Natalie, who has two years experience with the company and has always maintained a positive and motivated attitude with work. She has proven to work very well on a, on a team and has excellent communication skills, both verbally and written. She does possess a natural ability to lead, which will prove to be beneficial to the team as she is as she also excels in conflict resolution skills. Our second choice is Michael, who has more than five years of experience with the organization. He brings a positive attitude and a very high level of analytical skills, will be, which will be beneficial when looking at the smaller details of the project that feed into the project's main goal. He also has the ability to bring out the strengths in his coworkers and um, will be able to assist with motivating the rest of the team from that sense. Elizabeth, who has four years of experience with the company, also brings in a positive attitude and does work very well with others. She does have experience leading projects for Southwest, which will be beneficial to the team as she has ventured on projects uh, for the company in the past. She does excel with problem solving skills and is extremely detail oriented and also possesses excellent conflict resolution skills. Our final choice, William, who has four years of experience with the company, works well in a team setting and is highly motivated with challenging tasks. He will be able to serve as a resource for his team as an expert in his area. The team member profile has been assessed carefully to to review each employee's strengths and weaknesses and their ability to work well with others. And while it was not an easy decision to make, we did decide to go with these four individuals um, versus our six original. We decided to remove Caitlin and Susan from the team. Um, while, their, while their attributes are very strong and would be beneficial to the team, we decided that their lack of experience with the company was was the final decision maker as far as putting the, the team together. Some of the strengths of the team include that each member works well with, with others in a team setting and they have work experience within the organization. Team members must bring in a positive attitude and individually they each have notable strengths but when you put it together as a whole, that group can bring in leadership skills, analytical skills, excellent communication skills, and conflict resolution skills. All members are highly motivated and pay close attention to detail. Some weaknesses noted for the team could include the lack of trust with other team members. Um, we are in, we are unable to determine how often these team members do work together and they may be reluctant at first to delegate responsibility to other members and given that the diverse set of personalities uh, there may be some conflicts that arise during the during the project so a challenge for the management 
could possibly be creating a team that will collaborate effectively to achieve the goal given the short time period of the of the project. These four team members were chosen specifically based on their on their strengths, also considering their weaknesses and their ability and their ability to work well in a group setting for the organization. Each member of the team will be able to showcase their strength and combine them as a whole to be able to have a positive impact and expedite this project for the organization. When considering this team, we took into consideration all of their key, um, key attributes, their, their knowledge, their skills, their attitude, and collaboratively, this was potentially the most simpatical group with the best synergy to work together for this for this project. Some strategies that we will put into place to to motivate the group. Um, we will be pulling in from the human resources approach with which places importance on employees contributions to the overall organization. Each employee has expressed interest in doing greater for the company. And this theory encourages participation and involvement to maximize their input. And this in return to produce a high quality marketing campaign to achieve the organization's desired outcomes. Some strategies that we will put into place to effectively manage conflict. To de-escalate any conflicts that arise during this project, leadership will address the team using a collabor collaborative approach. Using the collaborative approach will help build commitment to the outcome. So leadership does need to emphasize the importance of this project and how it impacts the organization as a whole and employees within the organization. Although communication for a collaborative approach does take a little bit more time, effective leadership skills and communication could help cut down that, that time cost to effectively come up with a resolution by strategically using their influence and their negotiating skills to, to come to a resolution that will satisfy the team members but also more importantly, not losing focus on the goal project. To foster collaboration, there are key elements that leadership will need to, to have in place prior to the project starting. Leaders will have to clearly communicate the organization's expectations and goals, encourage creativity and innovation. Leadership will also need to create an alignment with team members to develop the marketing plan that will benefit the organization as a whole versus a department success. It is an organizational success. And this, this marketing plan will also impact employees and, and Southwest's customer base. When looking at the team selection, we can apply the four tenets of conscious capitalism, higher purpose, stakeholder orientation, conscious leadership, and conscious culture. The team selected has, has exemplified characteristics needed for this project to move forward with success. These team members have shown positive attitudes, enthusiasm for challenging products, caring about making a difference for, for others and contributing to a greater cause above themselves within the company. As a team, the members, be, as a team, the members become a much greater invested stakeholder because this plan will help build the future for Southwest. Executive leaderships and other employees, whether fellow employees know that know about this project moving forward will have an impact that 
could produce astounding success for the for the airlines. Now, moving into the value for each stakeholder. The stakeholders, let's start with the team members on the marketing team. They will have a positive impact on the future of success for the organization with their marketing launch. Due to their efforts, this project has the potential to prevent hundreds of job, loss, job losses within the organization, increase company revenue, and reestablish the organization's market dominance within the airline industry. For Southwest customers, they will be able to continue to enjoy the convenience and affordability of the airlines. And this project also has the potential to, to attract new customers to the airline. For Southwest in itself as an organization as a whole, including their investors, they will benefit from increased revenues and possibly gaining new market share for the airlines in the airline industry. Thank you so much for your time. And I will also include a link to this presentation on the PowerPoint that is included for this project. Have a wonderful day.